I actually always knew that I kind of wanted to be a doctor. My mom was a nurse, and so I got a lot of influence from there. Moving forward, actually, I came to Austin College. The first thing that I did was I signed up for Pre-Health Society and applied to become the freshman rep, and I was fortunate enough to do so. I was just really inspired, and I did a medical GO Fellowship, and I did a UT Tyler um, CSOC, and so that's how I really solidified my interest in healthcare. I presented at the Austin College Scholarship Conference twice and once at a national conference in Philadelphia. Even though everyone's a molecular biologist at like the national conference, their areas of expertise may be totally different. So there's a certain amount of give and take in terms of presenting the material. At the Austin College Conference, it's a much bigger group of people, but not as specialized. And so bringing it down in understandable bits is kind of what I've learned there. I was really drawn by the relationships that students can have with professors here. That was just the selling point for me. Student-faculty ratio, I mean, being so small, I knew that I would be able to go into their office hours and ask the questions that I need. I could email and they would know who I am. And so I've really just used that as much as I can here at Austin College, and I'm really glad that I chose it for that reason. At Austin College, I was able to do a senior honors thesis during my final year here. And in that program, I was able to work with a faculty mentor to develop my entirely own research project and complete it from the very first idea to writing a manuscript and defending it in front of other faculty members here. I feel that the research environment here and the creativity and independence they allow you has helped me grow a lot as a future physician that wants to stay in academic medicine and continue to do research for the rest of my life.